Hello, I'm Matt Haig. I'm the author of Reasons to Stay Alive, How to Stop Time, Notes on a Nervous Planet, and I'm here today to talk about my new novel, The Midnight Library. Obviously, uh, The Midnight Library is about a library, and The Midnight Library is a library. Uh, it's a very fantastical kind of library uh, that doesn't exist in real life, because it, it goes on forever and it's infinite. But for me, that is what a library is. And the, in a way, The Midnight Library is my love letter um, to libraries. I mean, I was a person, you know, when I was growing up as a sort of latchkey kid in the 1980s, the library in Newark on Trent was my sort of um, place of escape and freedom. If I'd had a terrible time at school and I wasn't ready to go home yet, I'd sit there in the library and do my homework or read books or discover Stephen King novels or whatever it was. And um, for me, a, a library more than anything else is the perfect metaphor for parallel lives because that is what a li you know, libraries are essentially um, portals to thousands of different universes anyway they're, they're our one one you know one place where we can go and free to be ourselves and without spending any money at all enter and access different worlds so when i thought of parallel lives i instantly thought of a library and the librarian herself who acts as nora's guide through the novel um, mrs elm she's a sort of an amalgam of different librarians and english teachers and people people i've known in my life and um so yeah, for me, even though it's a total fantasy novel, there's a lot of autobiographical stuff in there and a lot of my passionate, genuine feelings about libraries, librarians and the power of books.